Hi, today I'm going to show you how to automatically place uh, openings in the structural model based on windows in the architectural model. So this is a sample architectural model, that's a Revit link, and here are our structural walls. So instead of making all those openings manually, you could just do this. And now we have openings in the structural model as well. So let me show you how it's done, but before that, consider subscribing to my channel and my website. Uh, it's going to help me create more content. And also subscribing to my website is going to give you some freebies. Um, uh, I'm going to send you my free ebook and other bonus materials so check it out so let's see what's happening here this is a simple dynamo script well maybe not so simple since uh, there are two custom python nodes inside and this is uh, this is the dynamo player so as you know uh, here we choose a certain folder and it shows all the dynamo graphs in that folder and if we click on that icon it says edit inputs so we can actually edit the inputs so how does it work first uh, we select uh, all our walls you don't have uh, to select uh, only the walls because there is uh, already filtering um, inside the node inside the dynamo graph so it doesn't really matter what you select uh, the walls are filtered anyway and then we select what are we looking for and in this case we're looking for the windows in that linked model here on the top input actually we, s s we type in uh, the name of our linked model and that name is arc1 in this case and here we choose the family that we place because what we actually are placing let me hide this for a second is a window family that is with no window geometry at all it's uh, just uh, family with instance parameters here for its uh, height and width so this is very important that we are using instance parameters so we can just make any type of rectangular opening with uh, this family and below that are the names of these parameters that I just showed you that we want to populate with the dimensions of the windows in the architectural model so once we have selected uh, the walls that uh, we want to use we can just press on play and the dynamo graph is placing all those openings on the exact spot where the windows in the architectural model are and how does it look on the inside you know when you click on that uh, pencil icon you can open uh, the dynamo graph in dynamo and see how does it look here are the inputs select model elements the name of the link to document the categories that we would like to use windows in this case you might want to use doors as well uh, the opening family and its parameters here's um, python uh, script that gets the linked windows as instances in the first 
box here and as types here then there is uh, the filtering of the wall that I mentioned and here we check um, if the bounding box of the window intersects um, with uh, the wall and at the same time if um, the wall in our model, in the structural model in this case is uh, parallel to the wall in the architectural model and then we get the windows uh, locations and the parameters we place the windows the openings and then we adjust their instance parameters so this is uh, how this dynamograph works and if you liked uh, the video I would encourage you to press the like button if you didn't like it you can press the other one you know what to do and of course if you have some inquiries uh, some questions about this uh, uh, script you can uh, go and uh, fill the form on my website or you can um, you can just send me an email I'll leave my email below in the description of the video um, so that's it for now thank you for watching and have a great day bye bye